Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to Greenwood. Let's walk this way, please. To the reservoir. Rainwater would run off the roof, be guttered down through this corner column, and then under the uh, cisterns. There was one on each corner of the house originally, but now we just have the one remaining. This is a sugarcane kettle. <clears throat> These large kettles that you see on the ground here, this is what they would boil the juice in from the sugarcane. It would thicken and make molasses. There's more to the process, but eventually it would crystallize. These trees were planted right after the Civil War. And, uh, the, the original landscaping was devastated. Good morning. I see you have your camera, sir. It is okay to use it inside the house. Welcome to Greenwood. Second door on your left. Okay, here I am. Thank you for waiting. I'd like to welcome all of you here. My name is Daphne, and I'll try to make sure you have a good time. This is the home of Mr. and Mrs. Richard Barnes. They live here on the third floor. The third floor was originally an attic space. They have built a complete modern apartment up in the attic. So this, this marble top table was $2. So that tells you a little something about inflation, doesn't it? These two paintings are original as well. These are two of the Barrow children. They had 10 children. Only five of them grew to adulthood, and these are two of those five. This little... No question? Did she introduce you to Mr. Henry Hurst right here? <laughs> That's me. <laughs> the videotape she said we had out in the shop, he's the videographer. So you're on film today. <laughs> okay. When you look across the river, you're gonna see three great big huge stacks. That is a coal powered electric plant. Louisiana is the number one natural gas producing state in the union. And I, I have to eat with electricity made from coal. <laughs> What's it meant, Julie? You take five pounds of sugar and a gallon of water and you boil it down. Now, the difference I do is I boil the mint leaves with the boiling water and the sugar, separate syrup. And the mint gets into the water. Then you take the coolest syrup down, one part syrup, one part water, one part bourbon. <coughs> and that's it. Crushed mint leaves and ice in the bottom of the glass. What? Yeah. <laughs> you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? 